Hey guys, welcome to the review. Now today we pit the pot out. So, get to it. Part two came out in 2011. Drama narrative 2010. I'm trying to get through it because I don't want it to be disturbed again. This this recording is cursed. Voldemort finds the Elder Wand. Blah 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 blah. blah. No one needs to know that. Okay, Grip Hook breaks him into the bank and then ditches him, but he's killed later with the onslaught attack. So they escape. The gang escape on Dragon. Also, they take the Hogsmeade route. We meet the. Don't fuck my recording again. Crow Death Eaters. They are with Snape. Snape, Jewel, and heads out the window. Also, Harry has got a gang of friends. Like, I mean, he gathered like all the people. Voldemort talks to everyone about giving Harry up. They break their way into the school after all the defences they put up. Uh, they find the whole crocs in the room of requirements for Jacob. No, I said my own name. Sorry about that. Draco and gang approach Hawk. Oh, they make Horcrux fly, and Ron goes at Gang for casting a spell. Girl set the room of requirements on fire, and he falls into the assumed fire, but the Gang managed to save Dra Draco and Blaze, but it's too late for Goyle, he died. Obviously, if you don't know what happened, the uh, other one got arrested because of some drug dealers or some shit. The Gang head to the boathouse after dealing with Greyback. Voldemort kills Snape, and they take the tear and look at his past. We see the reason why he was so horrible to Harry was because he took, basically, James took Lily away from him. Um, Dumbledore asked Snape to kill him. So it doesn't hurt Dra Draco's psyche, so he doesn't actually fully convert to the dark side. Harry is a horcrux, he needs to die. Harry goes into the woods and meets his family, because his resurrection stone was in the snitch that was given to him in the first film. Hagrid is in the woods with Voldemort and he gets killed. We see Dumbledore as... A ghost. Also, we see Voldem baby Voldemort shows how weak he is. How his body is presented to mates. Um, uh, Neville drags out the conversation or not till Harry gets time to get up. Uh, now, the new battle starts. Final scene start up. Bellatrix is killed by Molly. Voldemort heads off to Harry. We get the really cool best fight. We get the upstairs fight. They attack each other into the final duel. Bellatrix, oh, we have read that. Neville kills Nagini, which is the last Horcrux. Harry disarms Voldemort, he turns to dust. We see the aftermath of fight. Harry destroys the Elder Wand, and also one of the twins died as well. We see it 19 years later where they all have kids, and he, Harry named him Albus Severus Potter, which is Albus Dumbledore, Severus Snake, yeah. I give it a 10 out of 10. The films that are coming are Red Dragon, American Wealth in London. Troll Hunter and Science of the Lambs. I hope you guys do enjoy. Please do smash up. I'll see you guys in tomorrow with these reviews. These are literally going all tomorrow. Bye bye.